Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Romance Three Kingdoms 10. I'm the Mysterious JG. Last time, we captured a gate, we captured Guan Yu, and we killed the God of War. Ares. No, so, yeah, last time was definitely an interesting video. I've got an idea that's bound to sell. I didn't actually mean to talk to you, but I'm going to have to ignore you. My fame has decreased by four. I just killed the God of War! Let's go to council. Order ain't that hot. Defense has been wrecked by Guan Yu's army. That's never going to happen again, unless he leads his ghost warriors after us, because we killed his ass. In the meantime, however... Whose loyalty is low? Got quite a few people whose loyalty has sunk down to, like, the 90s. I'm surprised that, uh... We're not allowed to. I guess we can only give out gold as a reward every so often, and we've already done it recently. But we saw Jing Tsai is down there along with the Kiao's and Yao Chan, Wu Lin Qi. All these officers have 100. Uh, I'm looking for someone specific right now. I saw here the sworn brothers from that other game, the brother from another mother. But, um, Dugan, he's not who I'm looking for. You'd see, we should go welcome him, folks. Guan Ping, loyalty 100. I'm gonna save this. I'm gonna save state. I just, I'm, I'm curious about something at this point. Red hair? Oh, I've got red hair now! <laughs> I killed Guan Yu, so I have red hair! And blue dragon! I forgot about that. Retreat certain speed up. Drink with other officers. Holy shit, dude. Now that... I've got blue dragon, so my war went up by five. I was, I was thinking of giving... Of giving a gift to Guan Ping, and I was going to give him something that really isn't all that terribly powerful or important. But now I'm like, bonus five to war. So a real, a real dick move would be like, I killed Guan Yu and took the most valuable weapon in the world. Here's my total fuck you, mo you mo uh, to Guan Ping. It's like, I'm not going to give you red hair. I'm not going to give you blue dragon. I'm going to give you one of these things that does a bonus to war that isn't anywhere nearly as near as impressive as those. You have awarded the following item to Guan Ping, broadsword. We've grown much closer. Guan Ping's loyalty has increased. Because I was curious if he's like... If he declared me nemesis, but he did it like quietly, he's planning, he's plotting against me, but he didn't openly declare it like those others. Second son of Guan Ding adopted by Guan Yu. Friendship is still close. So it's like, yeah, I killed your dad and I got this incredible legendary weapon from him. Here's a different weapon that's less valuable. Have it as a gift. <laughs> So he's the biggest asshole in the history of the world, apparently. Alright, in the meantime, um... We got a high enough popula- well, what's the population in this city? And what units do we really need to, um... to recruit for? I guess it doesn't show us there what the population is. Uh, 80,100. That's not very high. That's even lower. None of these cities can really afford to recruit. Oh, wow. Cao Cao has, like, recruited the Central Plains to near 
total death. Well, my best units are all doing pretty good. There's a couple of crap units here that I leave behind, but that does make the city a tempting target when I march out. But I feel like I can't really, uh, don't have enough people left in the city for me to do a lot of recruiting, so... Let's use some tactics, maybe. Inspect. Master Lukai could do that, so could Master She Grimmeth, but he's good at everything, so I'll let somebody else take care, take care of that. Oh, you know who I also need to check on? Another officer I need to check on is uh, Juge Leon. Because I think we took over the city where he used to live. He's in Jiangling. Oh no, we did that in a video and then that was sort of taken back, as it were. Uh, well, I'm gonna have everybody work on increasing order and I'm gonna go pay a little visit to Zhuge Leon. Our troop to fight defeated some of your keys, guys. Now, I do have to be kind of careful now, because now I've got nemeses who will kill me on sight. Which means I have to be careful about where I go and who I run into. Is that where we said that Juge Liang was? Or Jiang Ling? Also, Super Farm has initiated an attack on Jiang Yang. That's good. Good luck, guy. I've got Blue Dragon, so I'm gonna fight. Yes, I've got Blue Dragon now. That's plus five to war. This is probably still a really stupid idea. I'm all pumped up because I got Blue Dragon. You didn't even freaking earn Blue Dragon. That should be Grimmets. No point in giving it to Grimmets. He's already got a freaking hundred more. Yeah, Grimmeth may have defeated Guan Yu in a duel, but I'm gonna fight a guard. Show that Grimmeth how it's done, and I'm gonna fucking miss with my special attack against the guard. Oh, I guess it does hit him. Oh, swing. Swing beats evade for some bizarre reason. I thought uh, I was thinking that he used evade just because I saw that he used something that beat evade. I was honestly. okay. Now it's time for the guard to strike back. For some reason, everyone thinks the Guard Strikes Back is the best Star Wars movie. I never enjoyed that as much as Return of the Jedi. Although everyone tells me Return of the Jedi sucked because the game was a little kid. Oh, why did I use Strike? Oh man, I'm just not paying attention. I used Strike because that like goofy ring, ring, ring sound convinced me that like the next blow was going to have high attack power. But no, it was going like that because I was dizzy. And I wasn't paying attention. I started paying pretty close attention during that uh, duel at the end with Guan Yu. <laughs> and yes, Zhou Yu with Blue Dragon is able to defeat a guard. So that's good. And it's fame is risen by one. It's like, yeah, I lost fame because I didn't want to sell stuff for some freaking merchant, but now. <laughs> now that I've got Blue Dragon and I'm going around using it to defeat guards, everything's coming up roses. Let's try to pay three or, or possibly more visits to Zhuge Liang. He will be at the blacksmith. Zhou Yu, you won't escape my revenge this time. Ah, oh, shit. You better repent your sins while you still have the chance. Will I view this duel? Yes, but I'm now realizing that. Ghost's <laughs> awesome. I've waited a long time for this. All right, let's end this. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I'm surprised it's going to make me go through with it. With the war advantage I have, I thought I would get an auto win. Problem is, if I run into Quan Suo or Zhang, if I run into Zhang Fei, I am dead. I am absolutely dead. I have basically got to get back to a Wu City 
toot sweet because I forgot about this. Now that I've got Nemesis, is this he's, they will attack me on sight, and I won't be able to escape from the duels. And if I run into uh, Jank Fei, I will die. There is no way I'm going to be able to defeat Jank Fei in a duel using Jin. be like steeple slope bridge except that uh, it'll be like instead of him screaming and scaring away lots of people he'll just fucking murder me so it really won't be that much like steeple slope bridge at all except for the fact that it'll be blowing up the power however this is fun because I get to beat up members of the Tsao clan I, there's probably no one in the Tsao clan that I can't defeat in a one on one duel except possibly uh, his eldest son I can't remember his name Tsao Pong maybe he was supposed to be kind of like a, a tough combat-y type badass. But yeah, if I run into Zhang Fei, I'm dead. And any of Guan Yu's kids can probably beat uh, Zhou Yu in a duel, too. What are you thinking? You attack me like that? Ridiculous. I don't believe it. I didn't get to finish him off, though. This is dangerous business here, folks. I thought it would be fun to make Zhu Ge Liang my uh, oath brother, but... I don't think it's really worth the risk I'm running now. There's Ma Leong. I'm in Jiangling. That's where uh, Zhuge Liang is, right? Zhuge Liang is in Jiangling. I'm in Jiangling. Okay, maybe he's in the castle or something. Where's Zhang Fei? He's in G, which is very far away from here. So that's fine. Shuge Leong is not here. Shuge Leong's over here getting drunk. Didn't expect to see you, your master show you. I figured you'd be hiding after you killed Guan Yu and turned a whole bunch of really badass dudes into your mortal enemies. Let's give Shuge Leong uh, <laughs> red hair. No. Let's give Shuge Leong um, the sawtooth blade. This item is called Sawtooth Blade. Please accept it. Sawtooth Blade? Okay, I guess. You know that I use lasers, right? Thanks enough for me that you like it. Yay, we've taken Jiang Yang. Good job, Falzer. I think that was you what did that. Falzer of Jin Yi reports that the city has achieved its current policy and is awaiting your next orders. You will be the prefect of that city. Time I need to try to find Juge Leon without Walmart. I have nothing to say to you, Joe. You get out of my sight. Yeah, I was wondering what would happen when I went over talking to him. Ah, crap. Now he's not going to show up. I'm going to waste a million turns trying to talk to Juge Leon. Sorry, I kept you waiting. Giving presents to Juge Leong is probably a waste of time. He's probably set to, like, selfless, which means that giving him gifts doesn't do very much. No, you don't need to thank me. Maybe we've grown closer. Usually the smarty pants officers end up in uh the uh Ma Tang is working for Kim Has altered our district policy, we now want to attack the central plains. He doesn't even want us to rescue him anymore. He's like, just take over China, damn it. Whatever you do it do it how however you feel is best. So what happened to Juge Leong? Did they somebody have the good sense to pull him out of here before I can bribe him? Jiang Ling. Yeah, he's still in the city somewhere. I thought I'd been through all these places already. Lukai's done his thing. I, I thought I'm sure I searched there and there. 
Where did I forget? The gate? Guardhouse? I've been to these places. I'm wasting time. Oh, you're hiding in a place with lots of other dudes. What other gift items have I got? What other prizes do I have for Shigi Leong? <laughs> Shigi Leong, you could win the Warriors Advanced Medicine. Hearing is an order, but I don't really know what that does. Treasure is a good safe bet. Bronze horse guard. Here, I'd like Master Shigi Leong to have this bronze horse guard. Bronze horse guard, great, thanks. We've grown closer. Probably better off just talking to him. This doesn't really seem to be moving it along at all. No matter how skilled you are at war, sometimes a quick tongue is all it takes to change the world. <laughs> a quick tongue. I think it's so many dirty jokes for that one. Show you and Juge Leong have, oddly enough, not become best friends after Show Yu's kind of his jokes. Let's talk again. But we are friends. I value a good Cunnilingus joke, much in the way that my wife would value Cunnilingus if I ever gave it to her. Ah, it's suddenly turned really dirty for no good reason. Closer. And. Friends. There he is. You thought you'd hide out in the granary, eh? I haven't got time now. Try again later. I've got a million things to do. Can't you tell that I'm stressed out and rushing around? I call upon the thunder. Oh, sorry. I haven't actually played that. Ah, trusted. But we're not close yet. I want to get close. Closer with Big Red. Then I'm going to start trying to actually talk him into joining our force. From there, start trying to square Brotherhood with Shugi Leong, because I think that would be hilarious. Bait? Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, if you have the time, I would like to discuss the fate of the world with you. Shit, dude. This could go really poorly, too. Oh, what the hell? Let's try it. If you're willing to face me, I'll give you my best. It's anybody who should be able to beat Juge Leong in a debate in this game. Joe, you should have a shot, but nobody can beat Juge Leong in a debate in this game. Although, I've got all these cool items. I should do my best. Are you ready? Haha, <laughs> I hope to have at least a little fun. He's probably going to be able to turn this against me. I forget how the debate commands all work. You suck. Yeah, he's got like these super invincible commands. I've got refute. A whole lot of that. Your words seem to have no passion. Well, you're the guy who sounds like he's asleep all the time. It's possible for me to win this. Only fools say they can do whatever. Oh, I just made him angry. I can win. I can win. I can win. Aw. Oh. Got that on the board. I, now that I think about it, I'm not sure why I did that. I should have just pushed back his... I'll now push him back a little bit every turn. I'll win if he lets me do this, but he'll probably won't. Oh, well, he didn't block me outright, but... Ouch! Refusal to get rid of that seven as being a problem. Okay, I have no one to blame but myself for this. I should have just given up on that awe command a long time ago. Really hope he doesn't have refuge. I 
look forward to the time that you will give me a real challenge. Oh, fuck you, Jugi Leong. Nah, I should have won that one. Finally lost in a debate. But I don't think I will be able to win him over to my side without winning in a debate with him anyway. That was fun. See you again. We've grown much closer. It's probably worth it. I don't think I'm going to gain those other debate skills anyway. I pretty much just uh, cemented the fact that I'm not going to get the other debate skills with the... Uh, I'm glad you came by. Sorry, I'm not in the mood. Now that I've owned your ass in a debate, you bore me. It's like the capital reason, the capital region is in danger. Liu Qi has turned against us. Zhu Ge Liang spent, or <laughs> Zhou Yu spends two months following Zhu Ge Liang around, chatting with him. I know a few things about Fu Yang. Now we're close. Is that better than trusted? I can't remember. Sorry, I kept you waiting. Let's get drunk with Shu Ge Leon. What do you say, folks? You know I can't refuse an offer from you. Let's have a round. You're drunk with Shu Ge Leon. There's no, there's nothing more enjoyable than drinking wine with you. Hey, let's meet again. Shit. Now I risk not having any more wine left in my inventory. Able, and, and being able to get him to, to join us later. I can probably get him to swear brotherhood without a spy was discovered. Damn it, Jugi Leong, this is not making us sworn brothers. Damn. I don't know where else to go to get wine. I feel like uh, Jugi Leong has drunk the wolves. I feel like, uh, sorry, like Zhou Yu has drunk all the wine that exists in the world. So, I'm cheating a bit now by loading, but, uh... Your ability has always impressed me. Will you aid us in our endeavors? I know you're up to something. Guard, take this off for prisoner. Uh, I've managed to escape capture. I'm trying to hire Juge Leong, and they're not making it that easy. I can't remember if close is better than trusted. Apparently because of my special hero powers, I'm able to run away rather than just getting captured or having to fight. Should've just refused that frickin' um... Should've just refused the frickin' debate with him, frankly, but... I was riding so high off of winning a duel with Quan Yu in the last video that I guess I thought I could do anything. It would benefit both of us if you agreed to be my ally in the next battle. You must be insane to ask such a graceful favor. Be gone. Yeah, I think I need to get him off of their force before I can get him to swear brotherhood. But... And yes, normally I would not be loading state like this and just outright cheating, but... Rumor against... Juge Leon. Where is Juge Leon on this list? Why can I not spread rumors about Juge Oh, there he is. Yeah, that spy keeps getting discovered over and over again. Lord Jugi Leong, have you heard? It seems that Lord Tsao Tsao is satisfied with you. Ah, oh, Gops was a mighty weapon indeed. And I can learn Arrow! <laughs> Alright! Spreading rumors about Jugi Leong has given me special Arrow powers. Falling for it. 
give him gold like right away. Ju Chang is being attacked. Wow, I need to get back to our freaking uh Maybe I'll just uh I just saved state a bunch of times. I'm feeling a bit like cheating today. I'll just We have lost Zhu Chang. I was curious if Jing Tsai could hold Zhu Chang, but apparently not. Is it worth losing Zhu Chang for? Probably not, but now I want to see if decreasing his loyalty to like 80 is actually going to do it. I didn't expect to see you here, dude. Come work for us. I'm sorry to hear that you even considered such a thing in the first place. Come on, man. Can't be that sorry. Screw it. I just spread a rumor about Zhu Ge Liang, but now I need to. I lost my perfect debate record, which means that I will never learn. Uh... He's 50 years old, wow. He's like the handsome young dude or whatever, but I'm never going to learn uh, argue, incite, or taunt. Argue is useful because I think. It turns your uh, opponent's debates things against them, or do I already have that? That's refute. Uh, argue, I think, just nullifies them. No, plead nullifies them. I don't remember what argue does. Argue makes them angry. Insight makes them angry. Taunt makes them angry and pushes back their meter. I forget what argue does, so never mind. Uh, but I can still I can learn insight, but I can't learn taunt, so I screw it. But I got to return because they're about to attack Zhu Chang. Apparently. So we have a video in which I talk to Zhu Ge Liang and he wants to destroy the defenses at Yi. I don't really have time to worry about that, I'm afraid. I have a special plan to ignore the needs of the kingdom at large and get Zhu Ge Liang on my force. The best way I can think of to do that is to agitate Jiang Ling so that people can spread rumors there. Although, I'll try spreading rumors flat out and see what happens. I'm trying to get them in order in some kind of way, but... As you get cow. Spreading rumors against Zhang Fei is not going to do any good at all since Zhang Fei basically wants us dead. So, like, you know, what we get him to do join Liu Qi and fight for him. No one can spread rumors against Zhu Ge Liang. Zhu Ge Liang is way too slick and popular. He's not going to be taken in by this simple tactic the way that, uh. JG Mistrink, go get us another Sworn Brother. Sure, whatever. He's not going to be taken in by the same tactics that we used to get Jing Tsai. <laughs> like the best skills and everything ever can't uh anybody that we should be hiring who too is free nobody can hire him Let's give gold to Wang Kang everybody Wang Kang tonight and then um order order is falling apart sort of yeah it's not that bad guys can repair the gates until order actually is falling apart, and I will deliberate. Warrior! Warrior! Something, something, pedestry. My lady, Jing Tsai, send me to request reinforcements. Would have been nice if Jing Tsai could have held out just long enough for me to finish recruiting that warrior. But either way, that's going to be the end of this video, folks. When we come back, we are going to help Lady Jing Tsai 
And uh, while all my officers are off spreading rumors about Zhuge Liang, Zhou Yu is going to personally save Jing Tsai's bacon and hope that this isn't a plot that Jing Tsai has hatched in league with her father and Guan Ping to avenge the death of Guan Yu. It's Mysterious JG. I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.